Now, compound assignment operators. They calculate the equation and assign the answer to the first variable. So there's all it is is the assignment operator with the equal sign after it. So as you can see, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and the modulo. Now, like I said, it assigns the answer to the first variable. So here we have int a equals 2, int b equals 3, then a plus equals b, then percent i, comma, everything, then a plus equals b. Now we say a now equals, and then the percent i, a. So as you can see in the results, a plus equals b equals 5, and a now equals 5. So we're going to go into Xcode and play around with the compound assignment operators. Okay, now we're going to clean up the code a little bit. Um, I'm going to just delete this stuff out of here. And yeah, really I'm just going to delete everything. Okay, so I'm going to assign int a equals 3, then int b equals 4. Now I'm going to do an ns log a plus or er, whoops plus equals b percent i a plus equals b ns log a now equals percent i a and now we're going to do another one ns log a times equals b percent i a times equals b ns log a now equals sen i a so now what it's going to do is yeah this first one's going to be 7 then a is now going to equal 7 and then when we multiply 7 times 4 will equal 28 let's see if i'm right Save all. Ooh, I made an error. Okay, let's see what my bug was. Ah, right here. I put a comma and then I put that quotation mark. So this was a very simple error, but in most cases it isn't that simple to find. So A plus equals B is 7 then a now equals 7 and then a plus equals b is 28 and then a now equals 28 so that's it for lesson three um if these tutorials helped you out and you plan on watching all of them please subscribe to my videos and next time we'll be talking about compound or we'll be talking about more um operators thanks for watching